Hey friends, in this video, I'm gonna give you an introduction to abstract class in TypeScript. So, abstract classes are uh, different types of class. It's uh, you can't instantiate these classes. So, we you can only define some methods in the class, and all the classes those are extending this class will have to implement those methods. Okay, so the keyword abstract is used to define an abstract class so let me create one abstract class people and one more thing is that if you are defining a class as abstract you need at least one method as abstract so you need at least one abstract method you can also create some abstract fields here and if you don't have any abstract fields or abstract members in a class then these types of class are called concrete classes so here i'm going to create one abstract method it is let's say it is C and it will return nothing then I can create another class and that class is suppose extending this abstract class people then you can see that it's throwing me one error because we have not implemented the class uh, this method that is defined by these people so here I need to implement this same method okay so here I am gonna print hello I'm a student okay now we can create a class of so I'm creating one class object not class and I'm calling this same method now you can see that it's printing this hello I am student so if set class defines some rules so any class that is extending that class will have to implement that uh, uh, abstract methods so similarly if I create another class named teacher then also I'll have to implement this same method say hello I am a teacher and if I create one teacher object here and if I call it then it will print hello I'm a teacher you can also create one more methods inside these classes and more properties that's not restricted for example let me create one more method here hey teacher and inside this method I'm printing hello so I can call this t.c t.hey teacher then it will print hello yeah and we can also create non abstract methods in a master class say people hey people and this is not an abstract method so inside this I'm printing hello from people so I can call this method from any of these objects so let's say I'm calling it from this student object or I'm calling it from the teacher object so it will print that uh, message that is that defined inside this method we can also have some other fields in this abstract class so let me create one string variable name and let's say I want to uh, initialize it in the constructor. So here I'm getting one string and I'm initializing this field in the constructor, but we can't instantiate one abstract class. So we have to initialize it in the constructor of the other classes that those are extending this abstract class. Okay, let me delete that abstract class for now. Now you can see that it's throwing me one error because we are actually passing this constructor actually we have to pass this value inside this student so let me in the hey people let me print the name that is assigned here hello people i am this dot name and inside the constructor we can actually we can also pass it directly from here 
so if i pass alex then you can see hello i am a student hello from people i am alex and also we can do we can create one more constructor here and suppose it is taking two params one is eight and one the second one is the name name and it's of type string and inside this constructor we can call the super class constructor so for that we have to use the super okay so here i can pass the name that is name and it will call the name here and it will assign the value so the first thing i need to pass one eight and name now you can see that it's printing the name inside this this method but that's all for now if you have any question please drop one comment below thanks bye